Hey, you want to know how I got that used to be cut now scar? Um, no, not really. Great! So, on a bright sunny day, I wandered out into the desert to take this picture of me in York. Um, I'm out here with the boy. Here. Get him in the shot here, you know. Uh, it's York. York, you doing alright, bud? Hey, York. The fuck is up, dude? He is such an ass, I swear to God. Dude, can you... Okay, we're gonna go. He's a bit off, but anyway. On the way back, I walked through a little shrubby and dirt mound area and thought my leg was snagged on some cactus. So naturally, I rapidly kicked my leg and panicked. <laughs> a plot twist, it was barbed wire wrapped around my leg. It's, uh, you know, yeah, it's barbed wire. So, that is what happens when you walk through barbed wire. That's, that's how my day's, so that's how my day's going. Did I put a band-aid on it? No. Did I seek medical attention? No. That's why it's a used to be cut and now a scar. Thank you. Carry on. Um. All right, ladies and boys, my dummy thick, overzealous, Frodo looking ass didn't explain what I was doing today. So here's a 15 second breakdown. Go. Basically, since I'm no longer at home, and my birthday was September 29th, my parents mailed me a bunch of birthday stuff, as well as other random things that I forgot at home in my sudden departure. I also got a couple of packages from a company called Bad Dancers Only, but we'll get to that when we do. Okay, so that's that's basically what we're doing today. Literally just opening packages. And go. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's pants. My parents got me pants. <laughs> okay. Who tapes it that much? Fucking animals. These are my sunglasses that I ordered, but they went to that house instead of this one. Because we fucked up the mail thing. Uh, <coughs> that smells weird. Uh, it's from Kayope. It's from that, so there's that. This is my birthday gift to myself. Daddy's home. See how it kind of appears? It doesn't really do it on camera. That's cool. Glad I have some sunglasses now. So we got my mug sent from home. It's my favorite mug. I actually got it here in New Mexico. Oh yeah, and this is the bar. This is the bottle puzzle. So let's do that. Oh, and the ball's stuck. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Suki sweatshirt. This is from Bad Dancers Only. Well, I know it doesn't say Bad Dancers Only, but on the front it does, though. On the front it says Bad Dancers Only. On the back it says Fuck Yourself. No, it says Have More Fun. Um, but it's a company that I'm working with, and they reached out to me because they found my TikToks. I know. So they reached out to me, and I'll get like another box of like a bunch of shit. Got a sticker. Fuck me in the ass. Hell yeah. Got a fucking boot. <laughs> That's honestly kind of tight. And then this is just like a cool design, I guess. You're doing great. Appreciate it. I'm gonna give you like a little bracelet. Oh. How the fuck do you get it on? I'll probably just put this like on my stand. I'm not really a bracelet person, and that kind of bothers me. Sorry, bitches. So that's, we got that. Hi. It's morning. Okay, that's enough of that. Um, I don't know why the fuck I was so quiet during all of that. It's a bit suspicious, suspicious, sus it's a bit suspicious. I don't really know why I was so quiet. Like, I think within the same hour that I woke up, I started filming that, which would explain why I'm so weirdly quiet and mumbly. We got one more box. Don't 
Oh, hell yeah. So this is, I don't know how much I mentioned it in the, I might have to scream because the camera's really far away. Oh, you're Sandy. I hate having a puppy. It's fucking exhausting. Let's bring it down, you know? A lot of my packages went to my... It's, it's not... I don't want to live. Anyway, so this is the box, and I think it originally... Hopefully she gets picked up by a hawk, huh? <laughs> so I got this box, and I think I originally said I'm a part of Bad Dancers Only. I'm actually a part of Dance Patrol, that's what it's called. Um, yeah. So basically I got this little... Okay, this was a terrible idea. If you're asking which part, all of it. Okay, so here's the box. Right? Kind of cute, little thing. Got the secret handshake. You also get little stickers. This is a big ass sticker. I don't know where the fuck they think I'm gonna put that. Uh, they also sent me another one of these, which I put one of these on my water bottle already. Um, and then they sent me a white one because, you know, white people, all right? That's the guy who reached out to me. That guy, the guy in the gray. His name is, weirdly, Mr. Gray. I don't really know anything else about him other than that. <laughs> it is a clothing company. I don't think they have released any real clothes yet. Well, shits. Bad dancers only, and then on the back, it says Dance Patrol. It's pretty tight. Uh, the only thing I don't like about it is that it's black. I hate black pe No, I'm kidding. I've always grown up around... Can you guys back the fuck up? <laughs> there we go. Uh, I don't like wearing black. Um, this is gray, okay? This is kind of... I don't like wearing, like, solid black just because I feel like... I am white. So, when I wear black, I look really white. So I don't usually like to wear, like, black, black clothes. Um... As well as I've always grown up around dogs, so there's always been the factor of dog ass hair, you know? Or just hair from any part of the dog, really. I don't even think these are part of like their clothing company yet. I, don't, I generally don't even think their clothing company is like a thing yet. Like I literally think they just made these as like a... Just to give out something. I don't think these are like their actual clothes. They feel kind of comfy, so... Smells kind of weird, but that's okay. This entire bag... It's filled with these fucking bracelets. So let me just put it in perspective of like kind of what their whole message is. Um, I guess what our message is because I'm a part of, part of the fucking gang. <laughs> bad Dancers Only is about having more fun. It's about being a bad dancer that still goes out and dances despite the glares. My job, as a part of Dance Patrol, is to keep spreading that wholesome message. When I see that vibe coming off of someone else, I do the secret handshake with them and then give them the bracelet. It's all about spreading positivity, baby. Real talk, I'm not paid to say any of this, I just really believe in this message. Now back to your regular scheduled program, Cracker! <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, let's try on the sweatshirt, eh? Well, I'll try it on, you guys just watch, okay? Ooh. And it doesn't fit. <laughs> How are we doing? I can't... I can't even tell if I'm in the frame or not. <laughs> uh... There's that. And... Here's this. Thanks for stopping by for a moment, so. Ow! <gasps> Fuck you! I stepped on one of the bracelets. Yeah, two of these fuckers got out. You're not gonna come into every single escape vlog and just hear about me talking about fucking life and, you know, travel and stuff like that. Not every vlog. Some vlogs, yeah, we'll talk about that kind of shit. But other vlogs, it's just kind of what I'm doing. You know what I mean? Because I can't really show the phone calls that I make or the hours spent editing and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't really translate well. So I just show you the kind of... The stuff that I can, then I'll update you along the way on the podcast and all that. <clears throat> uh, we're gonna go ahead and, uh... Box this video up. <laughs> call it a day. Uh, I'll see you guys on the next escape vlog. Cheers.